Hey there friends, hello. Happy Motivational Monday. Uh, I feel like sometimes as a coach it's my job to motivate, but I wanna try and uh, give you a little bit different message than that. I don't wanna try and motivate anybody. Uh, I just wanna share something. If you're willing to uh, to listen to it and willing to check it out, I uh, highly recommend if you do anything this week, if you're looking for uh, maybe just a little bit of inspiration is to check out uh, the latest episode of the Swim Smooth podcast. Um, a old friend of mine, a dear friend of mine, I uh, reconnected with recently, uh, Stephanie Dixon is the guest on this podcast and uh, was uh, amazing to reconnect with her. Uh, about two months ago now, or almost two months ago, in Portland, Oregon, uh, at a swim coaches clinic uh, with Paul and Adam from Swim Smooth. Um, but uh, I'm going to post the link to the podcast in in the comments here, and I I really encourage you to just go check it out. Um, motivation, you know, uh, it's it's not even Monday anymore. Maybe if you're watching this, it's not even Monday. It's already Tuesday. Uh, but I think motivation's a little bit overrated uh, and really um, you know I'm just gonna butcher it if I try to recap Stephanie's words I think you just need to go listen to they took out a two-minute soundbite clip basically from uh, from her interview and they put it right at the front end of the interview and I think you should uh, if you do anything just take two minutes and listen to the first uh, first two minutes of that podcast this week and I think you'll catch the uh, the essence of what Stephanie is saying and uh, it really has nothing to do with motivation uh, you know we live in this world and where you know uh, or I live in this world where it's uh, you know we set athletic goals we set goals for um, uh, uh, for races and for training and performance and all this stuff. And I think, uh, you know, what Stephanie's saying is that, you know, we, we get so wrapped up in this that, you know, we become this person who, you know, we're not complete without having, you know, achieved that goal. And so she says the total opposite is that, you know, we need to figure out a way to, um, realize that, you know, we're enough without, needing that, whatever that goal is. Uh, I'm guilty of this. I think from a, uh, building a coaching business standpoint, you know, setting goals and not reaching it, realizing, you know, uh, you know, like I should be, you know, I should, I should be further along than I am and, and I'm not where I want to be. And therefore I, I'm not the person that I, that I want to be. Uh, you know, because I haven't achieved it, right? Okay, so maybe maybe that's your goal, person. Maybe the maybe that's something you think about personally, you know, in business or life. Uh, but I think it's uh, it definitely comes through. Uh, I see it a lot in our sport of triathlon and endurance sports that we're we're striving for this goal, and it becomes the end all, be all, right? Uh, <laughs> Nina says, "Love what you're about, Mike. Am I really enough? Yes." Winky, uh, the winky emoji. Of course you are, Nina. So thanks for watching. So anyways, I'm not gonna spend much more time. I'm here from a nice little spot uh, close to my home uh, where we do a little bit of, uh, well, we've been swimming here one time, Nina. You'll, uh, you remember that time. Uh, but I encourage you to go check out that podcast. Go listen to, if you do anything this week, Go listen to the first two minutes of it. Listen to Stephanie's story. And uh, Stephanie, if you happen to watch this, uh, it was great to reconnect with you over the last few months. It was great to see you in Portland. Thank you for getting on that podcast and sharing your story with Paul and Adam. Uh, Paul, Adam, thank you for uh, doing just an amazing job putting that interview together. And thanks for orchestrating it. And uh, Stephanie, thanks for, for sharing your story and inspiring us. Uh, for those of you who don't know, okay, just to, just to let you know, Stephanie was born with one leg. She's a 19-time Paralympic medalist. And I believe, it's at the beginning of the podcast, but I believe seven-time Paralympic gold medalist. Uh, if that doesn't expire, inspire you, uh, this week. I don't think anything will. Okay. So go listen to it. I will post the link to the podcast in the comments below. Uh, so go do that now. Take two minutes and maybe on your commute, if you're on Eastern time zone, maybe on your commute to work tomorrow morning, uh, listen to the entire podcast then. Okay. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching and listen, listening and, uh, you know, checking out my little, uh, little spot that I like to come to, to walk the dog sometimes out here on the Ohio river. It's beautiful out here and it's quiet. Okay.
Thanks for watching. See you soon.